We're not in Kansas anymore. This is what happens when you launch jet skis <laughs> in the Florida Everglades. Oh my God, there's a snake. Holy crap. We're in the Everglades. <laughs> Busy like most people are, we have so little time, a budget, and have big dreams to travel and explore. By taking adventures in Orlando, our hometown, and traveling the world, we plan on making those dreams a reality. To see what's next, subscribe and welcome to our journey. You never know where we might end up. Okay, so this one is gonna be a little bit different than what we normally do. So we normally go on the ocean. But we decided, you know what, let's check out the rivers, like going through the glades. So this one, we're actually going down the river with the gators. And so we're here at Camp Holly and Camp Holly is on the east coast. And actually we saw this place coming back from our previous ski from last week. If you guys watched that one, uh, when we went out to Sebastian Inlet. So. We found this cool little spot and we're like, you know what? Let's try the river. Okay, quick tidbit about Camp Holly. As you can probably tell from their sign, they're primarily known for their airboat rides. The cool thing about their location, they're only less than 15 miles away from the closest beach, which is in the Melbourne, Florida area. And I'll be honest, we saw a boat ramp, which on a side note is only three bucks to use, but what really pulled us in was the crazy dancing sock, which was perfectly situated in front of a food truck. Oh yeah. And of course we had to wash our food down with a nice refreshing beverage from the Tiki Bar. Oh, and don't forget to check out their gift shop, which might have a special surprise inside. Hi little buddy. And last but not least, you gotta check out the views from this spot here. Wow, it's beautiful up here. All right folks. This is a part of the Everglades, if you've never seen them before. So the gal was just telling us, she's down here in the bar, she was telling us that there are two of the flat-billed birds, but they have that pink color. The not flamingos are like flat-billed, I don't even know what they're called, but there's two that actually live here, just right over here. So if you guys are down here, definitely check out the bird. So one thing is, with the water being so shallow, we see a lot more gators right now. Okay, so don't fall off. Yeah. 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 See the fish? See him? Oh yeah. Oh, there he is. Look oh, there's at that. Two right there. There's two of them. They moved though. Yeah, those are the two low, and they live right in this area. And look at that little, little guy. guy. Oh, and there's the second one. All right, director. What's the plan? Since he just captain just uh, filled put you in. Gas in the tank. <laughs> <laughs> and then head up to uh, Lake Washington, and I believe this is John's River, so uh, Lake Sawgrass is to the left, Lake Washington is... You mean Lake Sawgrass is to well, the right? I was left when I was standing this way, but you know. <laughs> it's the beer. It's the beer. <laughs> Yeah, so we, why don't you put a, uh... Look, we got a, uh, sign here. 
We're trying to make sure which inlet we came in through or which little river because there's like multiple little rivers, but if you go down the wrong river, it can get really uh, shallow and a little sketchy. <laughs> Probably not the greatest idea that we've had since we've owned the jet skis, come down to uh, through this Everglades to this little lake. But it's all about the adventure, right? It took us what? Three minutes to get back here? Yeah. What's the name of this lake? Lake Washington. For all you Washington folks up there. Hi, Mom. Hi, brothers. Hi, Dad. <laughs> it's a different experience, and that's basically what this is all about. This is so, so cool, and I hope we see some gators. I mean, we're in the right spot for it. We're not necessarily deep in the Everglades, but we're in a part of the Everglades, just closer to the ocean. But. 12 seconds later. Oh, I think I just saw a gator. <laughs> There's like no one out here. <laughs> that is why. The poop water. Did you? Yeah, then he jumped back down. Oh boy. I hope we see someone when we're going through the back to the glades. Yeah, Nate has a point there. I mean there's literally no one on this lake. Granted, it is a Monday, but uh, I think primarily you're probably gonna find a lot of fishermen, that kind of stuff. Not really people with their jet skis necessarily because this isn't really swimming water or I personally would not swim in this water. There are some brave souls out there, which hats off to you. I could not, I just, nope, scares the crap out of me. I can't see what is underneath me because of the poop brown water, but I don't know, gators, kind of a little scary if you think about it. <laughs> wait, wait, what is that? So I guess we're just gonna sit here and chill. <laughs> Blake's over there shredding. Nope, it's coming over. So that is one thing that you could really do versus being out in the ocean. You can't really shred in the ocean unless it's like a perfectly flat day, which I don't think is very often. At least we haven't seen a flat day out in the ocean. So if you come back to one of these lakes or through the Everglades, like where we first came in, shoo, we go fast. All right, y'all, we made it back to Camp Holly and we're gonna load the skis back up and we're gonna head home. Like a pro. Like a pro, you're swinging to the right. <laughs> I'm sideways. <laughs> so. That pretty much concludes it for this adventure. Uh, yeah, about that. Do y'all remember the beginning of our video and how it started? Mm-hmm. Oh my God, there's a snake. Holy crap. <laughs> I was just about to turn around to step in the water and Blake said, Dad, do not step in the water. There's a snake behind you. <laughs> Thought he was joking. Oh, he's That's so creepy. And this is why you don't want to fall in the water. Lurking in the boat launch. <laughs> Look at him. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure where we're going next week, but I have an idea, and I think you guys are really, really gonna love it. So make sure you are subscribed, you hit that bell notification so that you're notified when we go on that next adventure because you're not gonna wanna miss it. Right, Blake? Anyways, we had a Philly, a Philly cheesesteak. Oh, I got really long legs. <laughs> Get away from me. Can I, I put you, you permission? Can I have permission? I'm fist bump, all right? I don't know. I know, I, I know. I got you gotta stay six feet away. <laughs> Smile for the ladies. <laughs>
Do not splash me! Uh, I was just about to turn in, or turn around. It's like Ricky Bobby. I had to go bad, just on the water. <laughs> I think it's supposed to work the opposite direction. <laughs> this, like, a lot of the lakes can connect to the ocean, but this one doesn't. It's it's sealed off. And as always, if you guys enjoyed our video, give us a big thumbs up. It actually really helps. And if you're new here, don't forget to hit that red subscribe button down below. Smash that bell, click all, and then you'll be notified when we go on our next adventure. See you guys later.